What if President Obama's administration, what if they were proposing American history standards? What kind of American history would we be teaching? It would be about victimhood. It wouldn't be about American exceptionalism. It would be about America's shortcomings and failures from a president who I don't believe believes in American exceptionalism. Louisiana Governor Bobby Jindal has been a stark proponent of creationism. Ah! Fifth graders are being taught slavery was not bad for all slaves. A recent study showed that 79% of America's teachers report feeling most disrespected by elected officials. But if I were king in America, I would abolish all teachers' lounges where they sit together and worry about uh, how woe well is us. This education system in America is awash in money. This is not a money problem, because every time they ask us as taxpayers for money, we give them more. Christie proposed cutting public education by $820 million. Where would you rather spend this dollar? Would you rather send it to Washington? Would you rather just keep it in your own home state so it can be spent on your kid's school? Walker's budget cut school aid by nearly $800 million. The 6.2% cut was the highest in the nation. The fact that we have too many tests, then make them fewer and make them relevant and make them better. Jeb Bush pushed a law that required a standardized test for every student, every subject, every single year. My name is Bobby Jindal. John Kasich. Scott Walker. I'm a candidate for president. 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 President of the United States of America. 